The big game in town tonight is the Waste Management Phoenix Open. Yeah, and it was a star-studded day at TPC Scottsdale. Tyler Baldwin, Baldwin joins us with all the celebrity sightings out there. Tyler. Hey, and we've got some breaking news. The biggest celebrity here at the Waste Management Open, Phil Mickelson, is in the Valley today. He's going to give it a go tomorrow. There was some uncertainty there, but good news for golf fans is Phil Mickelson, the ASU grad lefty, will be here on the course tomorrow. Tim Ring will have more on that coming up later in sports. Yeah, here at the Waste Management Open, they really rolled out the green carpet. We saw a number of celebrities at the Pro-Am today. Guys like Emmett Smith, Randy Johnson, even Dr. Jay. Most of the pro-am participants we talked to were quick to dispel any rumors about a quality golf game. Rushing leader Emmett Smith said he wasn't exactly feeling it. Like I feel about it every day, not that well. <laughs> NBA legend Dr. J said he's just trying to keep it on the course this year. Uh, I'm going to be the most improved player this year. Are I you? made a commitment. <laughs> you know, on 16, I hit one. I pulled it with high and left. And it hit the rooftops, it bounced a few times. I thought it was going to come back to the green, and never did. So that's the only shot I've been thinking about since last year. Cardinal corner Patrick Peterson, who just got back from the Pro Bowl in Hawaii, was the only celeb willing to brag even a little about their handicap. Like Al Davis said, just win. You just want to go out there and put up your best performance, and both you come out on top. d back second baseman Aaron Hill said he was expecting some jitters as he teed up today. It's nerve wracking teeing up on the first tee, but you know, getting to know the guys and talking to them at, through the first couple of holes, it uh, it helps ease the, the the nerves a little bit. But even his teammates with giant five foot tall Aaron Hill heads couldn't phase him. He almost chipped in from off the green on nine and drained this putt on 18. I think my best shot was hitting it through I know. hitting it through my head. So I mean Billy was uh you know not very supportive throughout the day with me, you know. <laughs> so you know, hopefully next year maybe if I come back I'm gonna ask for somebody else, but <laughs> Yeah, they were absolutely having some fun out there. One of these celebrity golfers played barefoot, all 18 holes barefoot. More on that when I return in about an hour. And, of course, more on Phil Mickelson when Tim Ring comes back later in sports. Well, the serious golf starts tomorrow, but today a whole lot of fun at the Pro-Am. Tyler Baldwin live at the TPC in Scottsdale with all the shenanigans today. Hey, Tyler. <laughs> Yeah, the crowds here, without a doubt, make uh, the Waste Management Open the most unique tournament in the entire tour. But some of the scenes that we saw at today's pro uh, pro am could rival only the spectator seating over on the 16th hole, including one golfer today who golfed all 18 holes barefoot. You aren't going to see this very often on a PGA Tour event. That shoeless golfer is two-time Super Bowl winning quarterback Jim McMahon. So much nicer this year than last. It was freezing <laughs> last year. I had to wear long pants and shoes and everything else. So you actually had to wear some shoes the last time you were out? Oh, yeah. It was, it was brutally cold. However, the most talked about spectacle on the course today came from the gallery following Diamondbacks second baseman Aaron Hill. I didn't know exactly what it was going to be, but... I knew it, I thought it was going to be a little smaller, to tell you the truth. <laughs> Several of his teammates, like Josh Colmenter and Patrick Corbin, followed Hill from hole three to 18. He loved it. I mean, bent over laughter. Billy was great. That was the best part about it was he said, you guys come with us. We'll walk. You know, we got to walk pretty much the whole course with them, and it was great. At one point, Josh Colmenter upped the ante, drawing a pirate's eye patch and nose ring on his Aaron Hill poster. Yeah, we, we just thought we'd have fun with it and put some sayings on the back of them and some drawings and stuff just to spice it up. So it was a good time. Oh, my God. I don't know, I don't know where that came from, but uh, definitely not going to happen. You going to take that one home? I know. I should sign it. Josh is going to put it up in his bedroom, I think. <laughs> However, the monster-sized likenesses didn't phase the silver slugger, who almost knocked down this chip in from some 60 feet out on nine and then drained his final putt on 18. Well, he said he topped his first drive, so as long as he was playing bad before we got here, we can't take credit for any, any of the bad shots. We'll just take credit for the good ones. My favorite story of the day, a woman came running by me earlier in the afternoon screaming to her friends, I heard Dr. Dre is golfing here. I had to tell her the bad news. It's Dr. J. J. She was heartbroken. But why not? Because this is part golf, part party. The fans now making their way over the bird's nest where headlining tonight, OAR. 
Well, the Waste Management Phoenix Open in Scottsdale, it attracts golf fans from all over the world. And as Javier Soto shows us, that includes few famous faces. The greatest show on grass meets some of the greatest athletes ever to play professional sports. Hey, it's, uh, you know, go, we're going green, right? The Waste Management guys, so... This is what this is for them. From Chicago Bears quarterback Jim McMahon to Dr. J. Julius Irving. But apparently whatever they did in their respective sports doesn't mean a thing on the green. All right, what are you shooting these days? Uh, too many. Too many. <laughs> too many right now, yeah. Uh, my game is not, uh, not real good. Hopefully I'll, I won't hit anybody. Like I feel about it every day. Not that well. <laughs> the Pro-Am at the Waste Management Open teed off this morning, and some of the stars playing were intimidated by some of the stars playing. I'm getting my stomach going a little more talking about it. <laughs> no, it'll be all right. Hopefully try to meet them uh, and hit with them a little bit before the range. And like I said, the more you get to talk, the more comfortable you are around them. And, uh, just go from there. Hopefully uh, everyone stays safe on the range today. But if Diamondback second baseman Aaron Hill was worried about shrinking a shot, don't worry, it's been done before. Uh, I'm going to be the most improved player this year. Are I you? have made a commitment. <laughs> you know, on 16, I hit one. I pulled it, it went high and left, and it hit the rooftops. It bounced a few times. I thought it was going to come back to the green. and never did. So that's the only shot I've been thinking about since last year. He'll get another swing because out here it's all good for a good cause. To be able to come out here and play this thing with these guys and have fun and uh, have some pretty amazing weather, um, this is going to be good. I'm Javier Soto for 3TV.